okay, to Dr. Yen, Dr. Zarila, and Prof. Saidi. So in today our video, we will discuss about the working mechanism about our sensor and discuss about the daily application in our daily life. Alright, let's go! Alright, so now we are back into the drawing hall of mechanical and uh, school of mechanical engineering and this is our EMC project for 2000, 2019. Alright, so I'll first briefly walk through about the components of our project. So one of the most important components would be the auto swing sensor, which is over here. Alright, so this one actually scans the distance between the, sen the sensor and the object in front of it. Alright, then we do have so that this auto swing sensor is connected to the controller unit. Alright, so built in on this Arduino board is a buzzer and an LED flash, which, will, which both will correspond to the data collected by the auto swing sensor. Alright. So in our programming, uh, this project actually replicates a reverse sensor of a car, which is which is uh, I would say a necessity for automotive world these days. All right. So for our programming, we have, we did uh, divide it into a few categories. So different categories will have different frequency of sound and different uh, speed of flash of the LED lights. All right. So okay, so in our programming, uh, when the distance between the object and the sensor is above 30 cm, uh, there won't be any sound or any LED flash as you can see from here. So over here will be around 32.5 cm. There is not, not no no LED flash and there's no buzzer. All right. So when the object comes nearer, I will put now at 27.5. As you can see here. This is the slow state of the buzzer and the slow state of the LED flash. Okay, as I come in nearer, so this is the high frequency of the higher frequency of the buzzer and the higher frequency of the LED flash, right? And when the distance between the object and the sensor comes below 10 cm, there's a solid state of buzzer and a solid solid state of uh, the LED flash.